say both jingles every time. So you dipped it in that big ass thing of bad ass. <laughs> Stop crying. <laughs> Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Right to Janelle. I hope you guys are having a great, great, great day. And I hope that all is well with you guys. And um, today, I guess we're gonna do- uh... Today is Tuesday. So we ordered tacos from Moe's. So I only ate at Moe's. This will be my third time in my life eating at uh, really? Moe's. Yeah, cause I never- I just... Every time you go in there, they say, welcome to Moe's. I love that. So every time that I tried to go, uh, it was always two packed for me, and I didn't want to go. No. Of, so, have you ever eaten at most? Yeah, have you ever eaten at most? What do you get when you eat there? We got the family meal. It was forty bucks, but with fees and whatnot, it ended up being like fifty something dollars. But we got the family meal that's supposed to be four to six, and we got you get two proteins, and you get you get. So we chose we get to choose between beef, like chicken. chicken, pork, and a couple other ones. We chose beef and we chose chicken, and then you get all the accoutrement. Is that how you was that how you said? I don't know. You said it. Don't say it. You don't know what it is. We got cheese. All the accoutrement. That's a lot of cheese. It is. We're supposed to be like six tacos. Um, pico. Ain't nobody eating all that cheese. You putting some of that cheese up, you gonna make some eggs with that. This is salsa. Mm -hmm. Salsa. Sour cream here, mm -hmm. and this is rice. Some rice. We got the cilantro lime rice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. And what? Black beans. So. And then what, we're gonna eat it with a fork. Yeah, we give you utensils. So okay. we just gonna sit here and put our tacos together. I got the tortillas. And talk to you, good people. Oh, and we got chips and queso. Are you got chips and queso? Dude, let me tell you something. I I will only for the longest will go to Moe's and just get the chips and cheese. So you familiar with this place? You know you got a couple times. Yeah. So look, guys, let me tell you about people. I tried to duplicate their queso one time in the recipe, but it's hard to do. So throughout this this week, you know, it's people who are call me like right now. You, you find any work? You got any work for us to do? Blah blah. blah. So boom, when I get work, I'm like, yo, I got I got some work for you. This like, oh no, right now. You working for peanuts. I'm here to make big money. Oh, really? Okay. So, don't call me no more. Don't don't call me no more. Ask me for my little bit of peanuts. That's all, because it might be peanuts to you, but it's, it's money to me. It's good money to me. Mm -hmm. What was you saying on the other day what? about not wanting to gouge people? Yeah, I'm not a person that gouge people for, for, uh, for, you know, for the proper, just I don't see no need. I just can't look you in the face and just charge you a stupendous ass, stupid ass price. Mm -hmm. I can't do it. I can't do it. I just can't do it. I want to make a good salesman because I'm not trying to go over on it. I'm trying to give you the best deal for your money that I will want. Right. Right. So I ain't trying to fast talk nobody. I mean, I, I would not do this as well. So what are you so, drinking today? Is that water? A good old bottle of agua. And I have. I licked this spoon, so I got some keep Some Bud Light. Yeah, Bud Light. I got water. So, stop. Which one is this? You said this one tastes like medicine. <laughs> yeah, anything cherry. that tastes like cherry. I, it made me think it tastes like it's medicine. It's like Vicks Nyquil. Right. I'm going to put some pico around there. I don't want no cheese nor the lettuce. I do. Oh, I got one. I don't either. know about the beans either. You should need. Oh, don't worry about it, darling. You I eat them tomorrow. Eat them that. tomorrow. Oh, no. I'm taking Emmy and all of that. Mmm. What's her? This is chicken. Mmm, -hmm, it's steak, babe. Oh, it's steak. Mm hmm. Yeah. What's this? Black beans? Oh. I mean, it's crazy, babe. Black beans. What you get people been up to? Right. How y'all living? Have you been able to get some work? Have you ever been able to go to work? Live your life. How you feel about the kids? Um, Doing virtual learning. I'm just doing virtual learning now. For the first nine weeks of school. Right, I'm cool with the uh, virtual learning. I'm gonna put everything on here. This one's steak. You ain't big enough. What you mean? I'm not, I'm not trying to, you know, I'm not trying to do it too big. No, we went to Newmarket, right? 
bread. For the vegetables, for the fruit and vegetables? What's the name? Neighborhood of? Harvest. Oh, I don't know why I call it New Market, guys. What's the first thing? It's not right. It's called New Harvest. So. Neighborhood Harvest. What? The Neighborhood They call it the Neighborhood Harvest. But for me, it's a new harvest because you I like it. It's a new market. Yeah, I call it the new market. Because it's new to me. New and I like it. So it's the neighborhood <laughs> market, right? The neighborhood harvest. Let her say it. Okay, neighborhood <laughs> harvest. You say it. Whatever. Listen, neighborhood harvest, I like it. I really like you it. You got a phone call today, didn't you? Mm hmm. They called me and asked me. I washed my hands, y'all. What did we think about the, the product? And how was the delivery service? Exactly. And if there's any problems with any food, anything. Oh, no, no problems. You give me his personal phone number. Like, call me. If the food ain't fresh, I will send you fresh food back out here. So I'm like, okay, that's cool. Good, 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 good. And they changed new um, vegetables. They, get new, new, they change the stuff up every week. Seasonal, of course. Mm -hmm. it's fruits and vegetables. Like, what grows when it grows is what you get. And they deliver early. Right. Look, I've been over in uh, P Town. And uh, the guys that I'm working with, like they told me. Up in the they tell me, I, look, listen. I like it, okay? <laughs> I like the food. <laughs> Go ahead. What did they anyway, So, look, anyway, in the neighborhood they in. Uh -huh. Dude, uh, man, they hit him up like three times. What you mean, for what? The twos and uh, stuff. They stole his stuff. Clean them out, y'all, and that shit hurt your man. <laughs> this something I, I don't like. You know, don't steal nobody's tools. That's not if funny. your lazy ass don't want to go to work and don't want to do nothing, that's you, but don't steal nobody's way of taking care of themselves right. for their family, man. That's, that's an ass whooping on sight. On, he said, sight. Yeah. Ass whooping on sight. So I'm trying to Even if they ain't my truck, I catch you, <laughs> I catch you out there stealing, I will whoop your ass. That's just what it is. So. I hope ain't nothing in my teeth. I gotta stop you from uh, it's my first taco. I put everything on it. Go ahead, keep jumping. I gotta stop you from uh, damaging the project. Oh, the people are terrible, man. Right. I'm still scared to lose nobody. Mm -hmm. I gotta do anything not to hurt anyone. Okay. You think you're good? There's yeah. some extra. Why you ain't get no crunchy shells? They didn't come with crunchy shells. I'm sorry. Really? I didn't have anything to do with that decision making. It came with soft ones. Why? I sad. know. I wanted the crunchy ones, and I figured, like, mm. I could compensate with the tortilla chips. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Well, it is, it is good. Mm hmm. It tastes fresh. I like it. Mm hmm. That's the best part about it. It's uber. It really tastes like, you know, it was like done today. Right over there in the kitchen. But it wasn't. Mmm. Mmm. Nothing I'm trying to think about what to talk about without pinpoint stuff. Because it's the same thing. Let's talk about behavior. About behavior. Okay, so for those of you who don't know, I used to be a job coach. So I used to work with people and teach them how. I used to work with special need kids and teach them how. Let me, let me, let me break. Let me think about this for a second. <laughs> so, i give you an example. So what happened is, they give, me a, they give me a special need kid, and each person got their own scope of how they learn. Once they laid it out for me, my job was to go into, like, say, for instance, they give me uh, nine students at Food Line today, or at, at, from nine to 12, and then from lunch, after lunch, from one to three, I'll probably be at TJ Maxx. So each student can perform a different thing. My job was to to assess everybody, uh, see who can do what, assign people to do things, and also to teach people how to carry stuff and how um, to perform their work. So even if people didn't know how to do it, I, not only were they learning, I'm learning stuff, then I gotta figure out a way to teach it to them where they can learn it around their disability. I love I love this one. One thing I learned is, 
I love the uh, special need kids because they, once again, it's an STP. They got something cool. They come in and they work. They don't complain. They don't do none of this stuff. They just want to do their job and be appreciated. And um, the goal was to get them a uh, to get them hired at the hospital. And that's what I loved about the job. You get you got hired. You did your job. You performed well enough. This company is going to hire you. Boom! Next year, new batch of students, and it moves on. Um, what was I talking about? I got who? Being a job coach. Oh, being a job coach. I don't remember that part. Oh. But sometimes the uh, I, I I got to meet some famous people. Hmm. I'm not I'm not gonna name drop, you know, because I, I don't, I don't do that. It just, you know, when you work with with kids like this. So one thing I learned too is, it's grown people with with special needs too. They act a damn fool. So it's my special need kids act better than some grown people did. Uh, and what I mean by that is, it's how you behave. You know, some people you, you can't keep a job because you don't know how to behave yourself. You you think that. Uh, you got a right to say whatever you want to say, and you can do whatever you want to do. Your ass is not going to keep the job. You would not be there for me. Uh, uh, for me, my pet peeves is uh, when I'm on the construction site. I don't want you. I don't like people warning at women or saying anything to uh, to females. Just keep your eye on the work. Do what you're supposed to do. Now, what you do off, off the site and. Uh, uh, in your personal life, as long as it don't come to where I gotta make a decision about you, because I'm gonna let your ass go. I'm not I'm not putting up with that. I'm, I'm too old for this. What do you mean? Listen, I don't want nobody bring their girlfriend. You're fired. Look, their girlfriend <laughs> coming up there and they causing chaos, because this type of stuff. I don't want to see nobody smoke weed on, on the site. What you do in your personal life is your business. Right. But don't come to my job site right. fucked up or smoking weed or um, Ocean Man. loud talking or cussing. You know, Right. I don't do that. It's and, and you know because other people, some people don't have no awareness of the people around them. They don't care what they say or how they say or what kind of. Because you think this music sounds good to you, right? That don't mean it sounds good to everybody, everybody else. You right. you got to learn learn this stuff. You got to treat people how you want to be treated. If you if you are um, you don't know how to talk to people. You need to learn how to talk to people. Like I said earlier, for those who follow us, if you got a problem with, you know, talking to people, then you should go and read up on this stuff and get some self-help books. You don't have to go to a psychiatrist. Get a self-help book and learn how to manage yourself and uh, carry yourself in such a way so you can show how smart you really are or how I happen to have an attitude when people question you uh, about your abilities. You got to change your... Well, change your approach and also change the people you're around. You know, once you change your mindset, yeah. the everything is gonna change. And the people, all the stuff, you're gonna have to change everything. Not that you're better than nobody. Not, that's another uh, that's a whole another topic we're talking about too. But not that you're better than nobody. It's just that you have a different perspective on life and you don't see things the way you was raised to see things or you don't do things the way people say you should do them. Right. Um, you do what's what's best for you. So right. my thing is Always work on developing your character. You don't have to kiss nobody's ass, uh, but at the same time, you don't have to be an asshole either, guys. Right. Uh, I know I'm talking to you like, you know, you're my kids, uh, my family, but you are my family and I love you. And I would love to bestow my experience upon you guys without sounding uh, too arrogant. Preachy? No, too, not, not preachy. What hot sauce is in there? All right, so the hot sauce is in there, guys, is... Um, Oh, let's try that one. Uh -huh. We got this new one. That's good. What did you get this yesterday? What is it called? Look, okay, now tell me. Please leave a comment. Is this racist to say it's Mexican hot sauce? I don't know. Am I, well, looking, look, am I reading too far into it? You've had to look up the history. Mexican style. Okay, maybe. Maybe that's look, the thing. Because they're going to call it Mexican uh, It says something. Mexican style. Yeah, they're going to call it okay. Mexican something. But then they just changed it to Texas P. I seen something about it the other day. Salvador. Right. I think they're in North Carolina too. You know, one of the Carolinas. Oh yeah, Texas Pete is in one of yeah. Oh, yeah North is, Carolina. All you gotta do is read stuff. Yeah, read. Reading is fundamental. Come on, read when you're on the toilet. Read. Reading is fun and it's fundamental. Ooh. 
Mm-mm-mm. So I think I might have landed in my first huh. like roof job where I get to do the bid, I get to get the contract, and I get to uh pay the people to put to do the uh mm. to do the roof. Mm. Not that I don't have to divide it, I don't have to split it, I don't have to get no percentage of it. No. Mm. Okay. Mmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Please, please, please. I'm not getting my ass up on the roof. I'm not. Mm -hmm. All I do is orchestrate, make things come together for people. You know what we didn't do? Mm. In the introduction, right? You did the great, great, great thing, right? Mm -hmm. Like, should we start saying who we are when we open a video? Like, for new people, you know, for people who haven't seen us in a while, maybe you subscribe or you haven't watched a video in a while. All right. You know? All right. And should we start saying, hey, what I'm Rodney and hey, I'm Janelle. Should we start doing that? The name of the thing is Rodney. It's Rodney and Janelle. I know. So what do you think your name is Rodney and I'm Janelle? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Mm. I don't know. I mean, you tell me. Let me know. I'm like on YouTube overload right now. I have been watching and totally immersed in all things YouTube for the last couple months. And my brain is like foggy. So, excuse me. Mm. If I seem a little off. So, this move right here. I mean, like, that I'm not off all the time anyway. <laughs> this is something you can keep eating. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. That's <laughs> mm -hmm. probably why this is only my third time eating this. Why? Because this is gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you too, right? So mm -hmm. when when I first uh, went somewhere I got stationed like when I first got a basic air team basic training, mm -hmm. I got it sent to Fort Hood, right? Mm -hmm. And Fort Hood. Oh my goodness, well well mm -hmm. I, I got I was there for it. Mm -hmm. And then Fort Hood. Uh, you, you get a lot of text based food. Man, w once you taste what people make from home and what people make on the side of the street, <laughs> and how they call, you know, when they come from uh, the taco lady, come the commercial and stuff. Time. The commercial stuff got to hold up to a certain standard for me because I've been spoiled by what I taste at first by people making food at home. And I ain't talking about no fancy. No, grandma didn't do none of that. Grandma had a regular mm -hmm. tortilla, uh, fresh lettuce out of the garden. Right. It, it, it wasn't that fancy right. about it. it. It wasn't the beef. It was just the bomb, guys. Right. Fresh is best. So just like with the la la la, la <laughs> what's it la what la palooza la? You know the no. video. The, no. Hispa uh, the, the um the Salvador the the Honduras. That's right. That's what I want to say. That's right. Oh, the pupusa place. Mm-hmm. Oh, so that's why I got the soup. Because I want to taste with grandma back that cooking. And I know the soup is the best. So I go to the place I want to taste the soup first. Right. See what's going on. Right. Oh, my God. Okay, I only ate two tacos. I ain't talking to you. I'm not talking to you. But I, like, I stuck them, you know, like. Okay. Well, I filled them to the max. Well, I want to eat one more. So. Yeah. I ate one with steak and one with chicken, and they were both equally delightful. The thing so, about it, though, is I think I like the steak more than the chicken. The chicken was kind of, mm, I don't want to say mushy, but I want to say mushy. So listen, how many of you guys had to cut your own hair, right? I missed the whole spot. Quarantine times. I missed the whole spot. Behind your ear when you... I don't, I don't even care. Oh, no. <laughs> Yeah, I, 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 I don't even care. Back there. It's like, yo, uh, am I going to? No, no, no. I just cut it off because I got tired of looking like Fuzzy Bell. And I, I wait. Oh, keep on God. moving. It'd be hot out there, y'all. Don't mess around. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> 
Oh, wait a minute. That's some old. But like, I ain't messing with you. This is for the chips. That's for no, the chips. No, the chips is. The cheese is for the chips. That's for the chips, too. Taste it right there. It's salsa. Yes. Sweetheart. You can also put salsa on your tacos. I don't know. I already got tomatoes. I don't want no loose juice. You, you do one or the other. You don't have to do both. Well, I made mean, say I just scoop the stuff. Oh, uh, why? Do you discriminatory about? Is that how you say it? Mm-mm. Discriminate. On how, you, on how you scoop. Don't I'm scoop right. everything. Right. Choose wisely with your scoopage. I thought it had some pinto beans in there. No, black beans. Don't fuck black beans. Oh. This cake is so much better. I gotta, okay. take, I gotta take a break. Why you See, take this a break? Why, this, I don't understand. Like, I can't eat a lot. I can't eat like a lot. You just drag me in this time. Right what do you mean? Right me. Right what do I drag right? you into? All this. My arm, look, y'all don't you don't have to talk about me like that. It's unnecessary. Y'all don't see my arm twisted. It's unnecessary the way you talk about me. Relax. You see how my arm twisted? Uh-huh. It is not, sir. I feel twisted. Can anybody grab that big ass? I mean. No, don't, don't feel bad. <laughs> when you call it pterodactyl arm, you got it. Well, look, I don't want to make y'all mad, but you know, somebody asked me a crazy question. When? You know, I told you about the. What I was saying, uh, Grace in the videos. Oh, God. You really want to talk about it? Mm, I ain't going to talk about it. I ain't Why you moving food? Why I'm moving food? Because I'm putting it up. Why? Because. The video's not over here. Okay, okay. Look, sorry, guys. I moved the food so we can talk. But at the same time, we can I didn't that. want no loose debris to find that. And I talk a lot. And I don't want all I'm saying to be in the food because my son got to eat something, too. Because I'm not going to eat all this. Sorry. Oh. I mean, how you know I ain't gonna make a lot Because you said you was full. I did sell full. Right. Don't be uh, st- I could still make another one. Don't be starting for nothing. What is this? A whole jar of mayonnaise? What is this? Sour cream. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what would mayonnaise go on the taco? Do you put mayonnaise on your tacos? Anybody out there? Put mayonnaise on your tacos? Oh, goodness. Anybody? You good. Never have heard anybody put mayonnaise. I put mayonnaise on hot dogs, not tacos. You you put mayonnaise on neck bones. <laughs> if I thought it would taste good, yeah. I, I, I don't know. I'm just thinking this out. So, I'm not opposed to using mayonnaise in several situations. I didn't know mayonnaise was in pimento cheese. I did not know that. Mm-hmm. Well, now you do. Because we got the pimento cheese from the... I know exactly that. The neighborhood harvest. Thank you. And that's how we're going to say it. Every time you ask, I'm going to say it just like that. Mm-hmm. Say it for me. The neighborhood harvest. How long have you got to say it like this? Neighborhood harvest. Neighborhood harvest. Hmm. Yeah. That's how we get down around here. We're talking about it too much. <laughs> I'm trying to chew. Chew, boo. Wait a minute, my dog time. I got food stuck all in my teeth. Like I got, you know what? Like I, I have a, I have a cousin that, when after you eat for hours after you eat, all you can hear is them sucking their teeth. It's just like, you know, like, and I'm like brush your teeth, cause like you know, like you know, floss. But now they would rather sit there and pick a pick. And suck on their teeth for hours. And I think that's where I get it from because that's what I would do. I would sit here instead of just like, you know, getting some floss, drinking something. No, you'd rather dig in your mouth. It's so gross and unnecessary, right? Mmm. I like those little toothpicks mm-hmm. with the floss on it. Oh. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. The little, the little like a, oh, a question mark. Mm-hmm. They're perfect for me. <laughs> My dad always keeps them in the house. Yeah, they're the best. The same oh, one, and he had a couple of them. That'd be gross. <laughs> would, you, would you recycle them? <laughs> I'm, 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 you recycle, you rinse it off, and keep you right. to the little minty flavor. <laughs> to the string pop. And you gotta get them, get the string out your teeth. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get a good flush, get a good flush. <laughs> That's nasty. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So this was Talking Welcome to Moles. We didn't do a thumbnail. 
You, she gonna find one in here, guys. No, I'm not. I'm gonna make another taco. I'll make a thumbnail. We can do this. What? You heard me. She gonna make another taco, but she ain't gonna eat it. I know what I'm gonna do. Don't do it. I know what I can do. Don't do it. They know what moles look like. Uh-huh. They go, uh, oh, double, 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 double. Dub, 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 what? That mo's, that something. That mo taco real. Mm. Is that okay? Work. Whatever, we're gonna make it work. We're old thumbnail, thumbnail over here. <laughs> I was. Okay. Busy, you can see for a couple hours. I don't wanna wake him up. And this video doesn't have to be that long. I don't even know how long we've been doing this. <clears throat> mm, this is good. Look, I keep looking for them damn beans. beans. From Bo Jingles, girl. Bo Jingles. What did I say? What was that about that? the wrong one. <laughs> I thought you were the damn. I was the wrong one. <laughs> you say Bo Jingles every time. <laughs> you dipped it in that big ass thing of bananas. It's, it's sour cream. <laughs> it's sour cream. <laughs> it's sour cream. <laughs> Shut up. Don't tell me different. I know. I think this is a new one. It's different. Okay, because I don't want no, no cream in my stuff. Shut up. They might eat that. <laughs> Shut up. See, I can't believe. Thumb down, thumb down, thumb down, thumb down. Oh. Oh, look at that. Oh, no. Mm. I'm not doing like that no more. Ooh. Look, what I thought I was doing. Goddamn, make your boogaloo this thing. Basically, hey. You gonna let your boogaloo? I don't know what that was. <laughs> mm, that shit did not feel good on the fifth lumbar. <laughs> <laughs> did not. Oh. <laughs> How? You count them, you know which one's the fifth one? Yeah, it went down. One, two, three, four, then when I get the five, it's like, oh, oh shit. <laughs> That's where I'm about to go. <sighs> Okay. Okay. If I had it, 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 you heard six, seven, eight. It would have heard I can't with you. I always let you hear the twelve. You're like, oh, your back is probably going to help. Whatever. Yeah. Anyway. So this was tasty. I think I might eat one with taco, but. There's so much going on in the world, you know, and I'm trying to stay positive and like focus. There's a heap going on too. A whole heap. So, you know, just I'm trying to stay positive. How are you guys coping with, I mean, do you even have to cope? Maybe you don't have to cope. Maybe everything's great for you. Maybe you're having the best time of your life. And if that's true, then bravo. Right. Like kudos to you. But right. If you're not having a good time, if, if you're going through some things, if it's difficult for you, you know what I mean? There are hotlines you can call. I mean, I'm, I may share some. What are you, you going to do? Oh, you I mean, no, because like it's like mental mental health is it's a serious issue. And like we should stop. We What is it? Like the stigma should be done away with. Right. We're gonna build each other there up. shouldn't be any shame around right. you having a hard time. It's not always going to be easy. So, you know, hey, we can get through this together. Right. We can all get through this together. You need us. Everybody around the world. Let's hold hands. Well. And sing. <laughs> well, somebody asked this person one time, what are the two biggest problems in the world? They said, I don't know and I don't care. And he said, oh, you got both of them. Because if you care, you'll want to know. And if you know, you'll start to want to care. You know? You, um, like I said before, man, my, my biggest thing with my people from my perspective, just my opinion, is you spend too much time uh, talking about each other and putting each other down. And every person think they are blessed, blessed and highly favored. But your neighbor is struggling over that. So, you know, I, I think people need to stop looking down on people and start building people up. Because uh, I think a lot of times people don't talk about their mental health or what's going on is because they see how bad you talk about people. They don't want to come to you and tell you something because your black ass is going to go and tell everybody or just use talk it. Or use it as ammunition when right. you get in, when oh, you get in an yeah. argument. Yeah. 
So you know who the grandmas, aunties, and cousins, and brothers and sisters. You you know who they are who will use stuff against you, and you told them that in, in, um, in confidentiality. You know they'll use stuff and throw it in well, your face. You thought you had a friend in somebody, and right. like you confided in them, and you were vulnerable, and it wasn't received with love. <laughs> right. So that, therefore, you can't tell all your business to everybody. Cause you don't know who's gonna be a friend today and an enemy tomorrow. Not that you want to make enemies with anybody, but some people are just only around you for what they, you can do for them, not for your friendship. I, I meet that all the time. Like, hey, buddy, hey, we want to be friends, we want to work, we want to do this. As long as you can get money and make money, they're your friend. As soon as you don't got no money, they gone. And then they had a, they got better jobs. Well, why you didn't call me? You always call me to ask me for work, but you never call me. To show me to another job where I can make some money. <laughs> That's my teacher. I talk too much. You talk too much. Anyway. This was good. This was good. Mm -hmm. Everything was very, very enjoyable. I was going to make me a, a taco salad. Uh -huh. But it's too late. Because I know I got to go out there early on, in the morning. So all I got to do in the morning, I got a gate. All I got to do is twist the. Uh, the ends together on the top. Mm -hmm. That's it. Wrap that up, be done with the twist and the ends up on the gate at the top and securing the gate. And um, I'm trying to go at 7 30, 8 o'clock in the morning so I can be at home by lunch. Okay, <laughs> I have a question mm -hmm. um, for the YouTube audience. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is a new setup. Obviously, if you watched any videos before the last couple, we were in a different location. So I want to ask, is this kind of situation better than the other one? And I'm asking, because I want you to go watch some of our other videos. We have over 100 videos that are uh, watchable. So like, watch our other video and tell me if you like that background or this one. Hey, another thing, guys. Leave a comment below. We keep getting subscribers. I want, to tell, every, I want to tell every one of you for the first one to the newest one. Thank you very much for subscribing to our channel. We appreciate all of you because we just started. If you see the first video, I'm just sitting on the couch with my uh, belly out. We getting ready to start this adventure. And now here we is here. Uh, I'm not going to say we didn't think we was going to get this far. We we just needed to see how far we can go. Yeah, I mean we only doing it because it's fun. You know what I'm saying? Anybody trying to be extra. Like, but I like being extra, so like don't get it twisted. It's just this is fun. And as long as it's fun and like it makes sense to us, then we're gonna keep doing it. And as long as y'all like it, if y'all like it, let us know. Right. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Right. Tell us yeah. how you really feel. I really feel bad. Because, like, look, we don't want no smoke, you know? It's all love over here. Yeah, we don't want none of that. I want to do is hear y'all say y'all prosper. I want to do is hear y'all say, yeah. that, um, you know, we made your day, or we made you smile, or right. we made you happy. Right. Mm, what you here. eat today? Like, what right. y'all eating today? Right. What y'all eat good? So, but, but, if y'all send me reaction videos, I will do reaction yeah, videos. Yeah, what, what else can we eat? Like, like, oh, we eat all the time anyway. Like, we just keep eating what we eat, you know? <laughs> so, I, mean, I don't know if it's like anything special because like our seafood boils done. Mm -hmm. Our seafood boils over now, like. But what else they gonna eat them big ass cockroaches what else, looking things? What else are we gonna eat? They look like the night ride in the face? No. Are seafood boils ever gonna die? I don't know now. It's like. <laughs> I never, probably never, right? <laughs> mm. See the boy for life. No. no it, I it, mean, but like, what do you want to, I mean, regular food, like just everyday food. Look, maybe we should try some lamb. Oh, yeah, we've done lamb. Yeah, we haven't did lamb. That's maybe easy. maybe we should eat a rooster. Rooster, because it's a Yeah, they call them a, um. What is, what is the, what is the, I don't, I don't say, know my rooster anatomy, I'm sorry. It's another name for a rooster when you go ask for it. Besides a cock, it's another name. I'm trying to think of what it is. Oh, yeah. For a rooster. So when you go to the butchers, you can ask for a, a rooster. Mm -hmm. Now, with the rooster, all the meat is just leaner. That's all. It's not nasty. Right, and that's another thing. It's gamey, our people say. Here we go. Another thing. Another thing we got to start doing is start
stop bashing shit if you don't know. If you don't know about it, don't first your first reaction is ugh, oh, yeah. Really, just just fill it out. You don't want nobody because soon as somebody do it to you, oh, mm -hmm. you gonna have a whole. You know, treat people how you want to be treated. I'm, mm -hmm. I'm jumping in right here, but mm -hmm. that's what it uh, made me think about, man. Yeah, uh, treat people how you want to be treated. This is what I try to teach my teach my self, my sons. I just got on one today about cussing. Yeah. Okay, well, so if you guys would like this, please hit the button, hit the bell, the notification bell, because we don't have a schedule. I think that's part of why we have so many videos and like the number of, sus well, our, our subscriber count is great. I'm just saying, I think we have to be more consistent. Yeah. We have to have a schedule. I haven't figured that out yet, like, because, you know, life. So I don't want to. I don't want to say like we're gonna post on Tuesday or Saturday, or, you know. So I don't. I don't know. Right. Because I, I we, we don't know. Cause we've been posting every day though. Right. So is you, you you gonna cut your fingernails? I don't know. Why? Cause I need you to help me come clean the, clean the house. Oh God. If I gotta come clean, I gotta cut them then. Right. No, you may not have to. I don't know. Mm. No, because we keep the money inside. Yeah. With, within us, because we need all we can get. We trying to get us a truck, guys. And pay off bills. No, so. You don't have to cut your nails. You don't have to cut your nails. You don't have to cut your nails. So? You can just come in there with that steamer and hit it with the steamer. Right. Okay, I can sanitize. Right. Sanitize with steam. Steam clean. Okay, so like, comment, subscribe. Mm hmm And until yeah. next time. Eat something good. And cook that bell. Bye. Bye, guys. Thank you. Okay. Do I do that every time now? I think, 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 I